morning. How's it going? Oh, I'm not going to do a lot of talking today. Uh, it's been a bit of a rough morning, a lot of snow and, and what have you. But uh, I'm rough as a badger's ass. I've been rough as a badger's ass all week, like so, full of a cow and that. So I end up just coughing. You don't hear me coughing my brains out, anyhow. So not a lot of talking. I'm just going to uh, have a quick look at a Swedish fire torch. Rattle one of them up. So it's going to be a short film, so I hope you enjoy it anyway. Just going to, going to get into one at local woods that I use quite a lot. So I know I've got, a, I've got a bit of a seat in there and what have you, so I'm going to be comfy. <coughs> I've had a bit of, if there are any birch in here, I'll be knocking up a bit of birch polymore. That's pretty good for a cow, but uh, we'll be right. I have a bit of a log store in a different forest that's covered up, keeps it all dry. So I've just grabbed a log from that. So I'm going to knock up a sweet, Swedish fire torch. Stick ways, hope you enjoy. Cheers.
Well, Sonny, soon get a brew on with that. Great little bit of kick, you've got some dry wood, fantastic easy fire, as long as you've got some good kindling to start it, I had a, I had a good, good selection of uh, birch bark, so, cranked it up in no time that. So yeah it's a great little fire, and you can always put a few bits in to keep it, uh, these are this part of that wedge that I've made. Ooh. But traditionally these would have been uh, designed for on wet ground, so snow or marshes. It's wet places where you wanted your fire to be off the ground really. And this is only a small log. This is probably this was probably only five inch. Something like that's only a small one. I'm only, I'm only using this for a brew. But if you were using a big log, you know, 10, 12, 14, 16 inch, these have burned for a long time. And if you will, it's a one log fire. That's all you're using. Especially if you, if you use birch. If you use birch, you're getting your tinder from it and everything. Take your tinder off the outside, split it down, burn it. One log fire. Always makes your cow feel better once you're in the forest. for joining us, Rick and Billy, Rick T Outdoors Adventure, so only a short one today, but uh, just good to show you the Swedish church, if you've not seen it, we probably have seen it before already, but uh, yeah, even just for a quick brew, it's a nice easy one as long as you've got the dry wood, but uh, I like can see it's still burning on top this, I could easily keep filling up that middle bit with bits of dry wood and keep it going, but uh, I'm just going to let this one burn out for now type down and do one but uh, yeah thanks for joining us again anyway all the best look after yourself and enjoy the woods see you later it was cold work taking them types down when they wet through warm my hands up no shoot off see you again soon anyway see you on the next video look after yourselves